Hi guys, it's Romina. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing the super easy and fast manicure for the fall. These are some of the colors that I got on my collection. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and let's get started. First, I'm going to start applying my base coat. Today I'm using First Base from Essie to protect my natural nails and to make the manicure last longer. This is definitely one of my favorites. Then I'll be applying Sally Hansen Good Canon Pure. This is Romantic Peach. It's a little bit patchy on the first coat, but on the second coat you can get full opacity and it's going to look super even. Now for the design, I'm going to be using Orly Tangerine Dream. This is between an orange and yellow color, more like a cheddar. And I'm just going to start placing some brush strokes randomly on my nails. Then I will do the same thing with Maniology Stamping Polish. This is Chrysanthemum. And you can use this polish as a base for the fall or for details in your nail art. It's super pretty. And then I will continue with Fun Locker. This is Ornament. And this is one of the most beautiful polishes that I own. I really like it because it's super bright. It has this holographic sparkle. So it really adds up in a manicure that could be very flat. So um, here I'm applying the glitter very softly. Just remember if you drag it too much, you're gonna take out uh, all the glitter from your nails. So it's better if you apply it in small touches just to make sure that you can get full opacity of the color and you're not gonna remove any of the glitter. Now I'll be adding some details with the Sally Hansen Warm Cacao. This is a dark brown. And I'm just going to grab a dotting tool and add some dots on top of this design. Uh, if you don't have different size of dotting tools, you can just control the pressure to get smaller dots. Then I'll be applying Maniology Smudge Free Top Coat just to avoid any smudge on the dots. They're not likely to smudge, but it's just I don't want to risk it. So I always prefer to give them a coat of this polish. And then I'm going to add a coat of the Good To Go from Essie. This is a dry fast top coat and it's going to give me the shiny and smooth look at the end and it's going to dry super fast. Then I'll be applying the cuticle serum. This is from Olive and June. It has a creamy consistency and it keeps my cuticles very moisturized. And this is the final result for this manicure. I really love how this turned out. Super beautiful for the fall. You can play with colors that you got on your collection. And I ended up doing both hands just because I thought that it looked so beautiful. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.